What if we could live forever? What would immortality really mean? This question is more relevant today than at any other time in history. Recent breakthroughs in technology and medicine are handing us the keys to unlock the secret to immortality. Researchers like Aubrey de Grey and futurist Ray Kurzweil are claiming the first person to live to 1000 is alive today. According to legend, Methuselah was the eldest human to have ever lived at 969 years old. Today, the top 100 eldest people to have lived range from 114 years 91 days to 122 years 164 days. These people, however, had all the effects of living with old age. Scientists are discovering new treatments daily. A breakthrough from the UK discovered a protein which can slow the degenerative effects of aging. Gene therapy is also making headway, and a discovery of telomeres, a nucleotide sequence at the end of a chromosome, may allow us to control the lifespan of said chromosomes. Dr. Aubrey de Grey gave a great TED talk on this, well worth a watch. But it's not just medicine that we have to consider when we're talking about immortality. Technology is rapidly coming into play. Some believe the day of the cyborg is truly upon us. This is where Ray Kurzweil thinks we will move, slowly replacing our biological bodies with robotic parts. Even as far as being able to download our consciousness, our very brain, into a computer. This raises more questions, maybe in another video. So let's put reaching immortality to one side at the moment and let's think about what would happen if we could live to a thousand. So for the sake of argument, let's say everybody born in the last 30 years now has the choice to become immortal. What would that mean for us as a species? I think it's almost impossible for us to imagine what are the things they should consider before agreeing to never die. They would have to think of the upheaval and the backlash that would come with immortality. Religions, economic models would all have to be hugely overhauled. Even family dynamics would need to change. But if you could see yourself adapting and changing with the times, what would be waiting for us? A utopian dream? Mm, possibly. We as a species build on the knowledge of those that have come before us. There's a flaw in the system, and the flaw in that system is the way in which we record the information. Natural disasters and man-made catastrophes have shown us how easy it is for us to lose this history. All our methods of storing our knowledge are flawed. None of them would last forever. They could all be destroyed. If we truly do become immortal, maybe we would see a resurgence in the way we pass on this information. Again, using people as the medium to store information. Technology would still play a major part but we would have an added benefit. We would have all the nuance that comes from our own personal experience. This would help us with problems. We would have a pool of knowledge to draw on to solve the small niggles in life. This freeing us up to concentrate on the bigger problems we all face. This then raises a new question. What if someone were to die? Could we cope with it? With longer life comes more experience, more friendships, bigger families. Could we handle that loss? This is my question to you guys. What do you think, what would happen if we could become immortal? Please leave your comments below. If you can, give us a like or subscribe. Till next time.